this is a stir fry thing. I was just feeling lazy this week um, and I will obviously add to it as that wouldn't feed all four of us. Um, and we're going to have that with noodles and I might chuck in some cashew nuts in there. And then um, I got some Maris Piper potatoes as these are my favourite for making roast potatoes and wedges and stuff like that with. Um, got some apples and then I also got some just everyday wonky apples. I quite like buying those. And I can just either cook with those, put them in a porridge or um, give them to the kids. Um, and I got some mixed peppers. They've only got ones with two green and red at the moment, which is a bit annoying. Um, but you can't really complain. <laughs> got some sweet potatoes, some sweet corn, some of these mushrooms. Chestnut mushrooms are in season at the moment, so they had these wonky veg mushrooms for cheap. And I've got an aubergine because that's going to go into a curry. Um, I've got some avocado. I've got some asparagus, bananas, carrots, easy peelers. And is that all the fresh stuff? Yeah, not loads of fresh stuff this week. Um, and then on the fridge stuff, I've got some hummus, some cheese. I bought this vintage cheddar and caramelised onion quiche as I just thought we always have pizza once a week and I thought we could just have it as an alternative to pizza. And I'm going to serve that with the asparagus and potato, sweet potato. Um, I've got some organic eggs, some natural yoghurt for the boys, some apple and fruit pots to go with that and I got a few of these I actually got two more but they've eaten them already they do another one that's got fruit and veg in it as well an orange one I can't remember exactly what's in it it's like carrot and I don't know but um, they ate those on the way home um, said hummus um, and is that all the fridge stuff I think it is and then um, moving on to this stuff is all like cupboardy bits um, got some vegetable oil, some orange juice, some bleach, some wipes, some tinned tomatoes um, and a tikka sauce. I don't love buying jarred sauces and we rarely have them but um, I quite like sometimes having the option of being able to cook so I bought some coconut milk because I could make my own but if I'm feeling lazy I would do that um, and then I bought two tins of pole online caught tuna. It's really important to me that they're the pole, the one, one at a time caught ones some coffee, some soy milk because that's what I drink and some some twisty pasta some gnocchi some dry roasted peanuts I get these for the boys instead of crisps they're probably full of salt yeah they're quite high in fat which I obviously don't mind because um, my boys are skinny little minis and then um, high in salt they, I just give them a handful of those in their lunch instead of crisps um, and then I got these lentil curls for me and John, for, mainly for John for his lunches. Got some super seeded wraps. We're going to have falafel, which I've already got in the cupboard. We're going to have falafel wraps. Um, we got some garlic and coriander naan, some brioche, some soft, mi soft wholemeal, soft meal, and some, um, what's this called? Taurine, malt loaf. I'm pretty sure that is everything. And that whole shop came to £42. I just thought I'd talk you through our meal plan. So today's Tuesday. We're going to have quiche with sweet potatoes and asparagus. Tomorrow we'll have aubergine, sweet potato and chickpea curry with rice and naan. Thursday we're having falafel and salad wraps with extra veggies. Friday we'll have gnocchi and tomato sauce with other veg inside. Saturday we'll have stir fry with cashew nuts and noodles. Sunday we'll have jacket and beans. Monday we'll have tuna pasta. So what I might actually swap these around a little bit. Like I know the stir fry probably won't last until Saturday now. So I will probably swap something around, but that's cool. For breakfast we have the boys just have some brioche and cereal. Um, and I like to have porridge and toast. Lunches, there's sandwiches, cheese and crackers, beans on toast. For treats and snacks, we've got malt loaf, crisps, yogurts, brioche, peanuts. This just helps me like remember what we've got and how to use it and what's for snacks and what's for cooking etc. 